Many in the private sector, however, also feel a high degree of frustration with the politicians. You start from bureaucracy to get a, a license to do a certain kind of business, and we're talking about a business that is uh, strategic or has, uh, let's say, uh, you need special permits for it. I don't know how many months you need just to get the permit. You need to bribe, you need to wait, and even after the months, maybe, you haven't filled the paper right and you have to wait again. It has been a mess. Harry Vafias, the son of one of Greece's shipping dynasties, became the youngest CEO on the US stock exchange when he expanded the Vafias group into liquid petroleum gas in 2005. He is unapologetic about the family-run nature of his business and the opportunities it has brought. He believes that many Greeks have only themselves to blame. The Greek young generation do not have motivation. That is a problem. They want to finish their job at 3 p.m. They want to have two mobile phones. They want to have a car since they are 18 years old. And they want to have a holiday house and live with their family in order not to have to pay a, a rent. How are these, gonna, these people are going to make money and going to have talent? This is just having a good time. You know, getting 1,000 euros as wage, doing a very simple job without stress and living your life. You have to sweat to make money, especially in Greece and especially nowadays. Do you think that's a fair criticism when people say that essentially the, you know, the, the, the wealthy sort of uh, families, business families and the political class are one and the same? Uh, the foreigners, you know, uh, they see one bad example and uh, they think that that applies for everything, which that is not true, as you know. Obviously, there are politicians that are uh, rotten apples. Obviously, there are businessmen that uh, do dealings with the government and bribe and whatever, but obviously, you cannot put everyone in the same basket. The same with the governments. Not all the politicians are bad. Not all the politicians are stupid. No. There are examples of both. Unfortunately, the majority were inefficient up to last year. I'm, I'm hopeful that in, in today's government, if they get the cooperation from the European Union, you will see that by 2011-2012, the image will be far, far better here. Shipping companies have been constitutionally protected from taxation because they're offshore businesses. Our ships, as I said, have foreign flags. We carry foreign cargoes. And in many cases, we have foreign crew. So we are offshore businesses. That's number one. Number two, that's nice. That is tax-free. But the Greek ship owners themselves, not their companies, are getting taxed in Greece. Their employees are getting taxed in Greece. But if tax on shipping starts out of the blue, then for sure the shipping companies will rel relocate because then they cannot compete. Many jobs will be, will be lost. A lot of income coming to Greece will be going to Monaco, for example. But with revenues from its two major industries diminishing, Greece's other options are limited. In March, a German politician caused outrage by suggesting that Greece auction some of its more attractive islands. But in reality, the country has been quietly selling off far more important assets for some time. In June, it sold Piraeus's main container terminal to the Chinese state shipping company, Costco. If you're nearly bankrupt, the last thing you have to be is patriotic. You have to do whatever it takes to get out of the crisis. And to be honest, this is the free economy. If you don't do a job well, you get fired. We're not, we're not doing a very good job in running our ports, so we get fired. And the Chinese take over. If I don't do a good job and, uh, for my shareholders, they'll put somebody else as CEO. It's as simple as that. What, do, what will they say? Because it's a Greek company, you have to, we have to have a Greek CEO. No way. You get beaten, you get eaten by the, by the, by the, by the, by the biggest fish. It's a matter of survival, the same with, with Greece.